Hi, I'm Jenny. Welcome to my channel, Jenny Beauty in a Minute. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you haven't done so yet, please consider subscribing to my channel. And if you like my video today, please kindly give me the thumbs up. And today I want to talk about another Kiehl's product. If you have been following me, you know that I do like some of the Kiehl's products, especially their 24-hour ultra facial cream one of my all-time favorite moisturizer and tier 2 retinols. Yeah, they have a low-strength retinol and a mid-strength retinol and both retinols are super, super products. And today I want to talk about an eye cream and this is their powerful wrinkle-reducing eye cream with copper peptides and calcium PCA. So this product contains copper peptides. The thing with copper peptides is it is scientifically proven that it does work and copper peptides does generate collagen production. It can help to reduce wrinkles and fine lines. But copper peptides for some people, especially those with sensitive skin, it can cause a little bit of redness or sensitivity. So that's the only thing with copper peptides. But otherwise, any products with copper peptides is actually brilliant. So it comes in this bronzy colored jar. It's got a little cap and the color of the cream is white. So I'm just going to do this. So this is the color of the cream. It's a soft cream. Yeah, it's, it's just a nice soft cream for your eyes. What I do is I just thought it into my middle finger here and then I just thought it right around my eyes. Yeah, this is a very soft cream. It's not heavy easily absorb and I do see a real hydration and less puffiness, less wrinkle and fine lines on my eyes. But the only thing is for me, I can't get this too close to my eyes. Otherwise, I get a little bit of redness. Yeah, so this is a powerful product with the copper peptides. A neutral scent doesn't have any perfume. I just hate any skincare products that has got perfume in it. So all Kiehl's products are free of perfume, alcohol, sulfate. I do like this eye cream and I do recommend it. I've done a few videos on Kiehl's other eye creams. I'm okay with them. I wasn't too impressed. It didn't really do much for my eyes. But this one with the copper peptides and the calcium, I find that it does reduce some of the fine lines that are starting to develop around my eyes. It does hydrate my eyes and just make my eyes look less tired and look less aged. So this eye cream contains three main ingredients. First is the copper peptides, or they call it the copper PCA. And what, the, what copper peptides does is that it stabilizes the elastin and the collagen fibers on your skin. The other ingredient is the calcium PCA. And again, the calcium PCA is, is, is there to preserve the collagen fibers in your skin, stop further degradation of collagen in your skin. And the other ingredient is caffeine. And caffeine is known to restrict the blood vessels to just prevent uh, blood flashing on your under eye and therefore giving you that dark circles under your eyes. So the other ingredients are just your, your usual glycerin, square lane, beeswax, sodium hyaluronate, adenosine, which is an amino acid, and so forth. So this is genuinely a well-cultivated eye cream. Yeah, having that copper PCA, calcium PCA, and the caffeine. So yeah, I do like this product. It is not cheap. So this little tub here is 14 mils, and for 14 mils, this is $85 from the Mecca stores here in New Zealand and Australia. So yeah, it's not a cheap eye cream. 85 is nearing 100. But if $85 is something that you can afford and you're genuinely looking for an eye cream that can help to st start reducing some of the fine lines and wrinkles, you want something to stop the collagen loss around the eyes. Yeah, my advice is do use eye cream and use a good eye cream. And I do recommend this eye cream by Kiehl's. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you haven't done so yet, please consider subscribing to my channel. And if you like my video today, please kindly give me the thumbs up. 
And if you have any questions, please list them down below and I'll do my best to answer them. Otherwise, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!